Hey, this is Vivica Von Rosen again, and I want to share a really cool little tool that my friend Jen Lerner um, taught me. So here's Jen, and you should totally check out her website, and you should also totally check out her toolbox. I'm going to go play in there after this tutorial. But what she taught me or told me about was a tool called Link Clump. So on LinkedIn, one of the things that I teach my clients to do is to do a saved search. So you do a, an advanced search on LinkedIn and find your ideal client. And then once you've done that, you save the search. And then what you can do is proactively view those individuals. Um, click, 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 click. Proactively view those individuals. They'll see that you viewed their profile and then they'll pro they'll view your profile back which will make your uh, rankings increase which is great but more than that um, you'll actually have hot prospects viewing your profile so if you do something like have a really nifty little uh, hero image or banner up here they'll see that it'll be engaging hopefully um, they'll maybe be encouraged to invite you to connect so there's a lot of good things that happen when prospects look at your profile but let's face it that's a little time consuming so the tool Tool she showed me was called link clump and what link clump allows you to do is open up a bunch of links at one time so what you want to do is Google link clump and then what's cool about that is it actually has there's a Chrome application um, that you can use and I think a Safari application and I believe a Mozilla Foxfire application now once you've done that um, it's going to open up some options. So that's where you're going to come in and click on actions. And so you might want to click on edit action. Now, if you have a Mac, um, the best thing to do is use mouse button uh, left and then optional key Z, hit the Z first. That will allow you to highlight an area with link clump. Um, and if you have a PC, there's, there's more options. But if you have a Mac, which I do, that's the best thing to do. You want to open a new window so you can just shut it later and you don't have to go through and shut every single tab down. And then you want to, uh, you just leave that as is. So that's how you set up link clump. And then I'll show you how it works. Once you have set it up, if you need to go in and change the settings or anything, just check your Chrome extensions. That's <laughs> we, we had a hard time finding it. So you just check. It doesn't show up here like most do. So just check your Chrome extensions. Come on in here and you can click on options and then it will allow you to change those options. So again, with a Mac, um, you want to use the mouse button or trackpad in my case left and optional key Z. So then what you do is once you've got that set up, you only have to do it once, once you've got that set up, you go to your profile, um, you can go to a group, you can just do a general search, but what I like is being a little bit more focused or strategic than that, so I'll actually go to my saved searches I'll choose the search. So these are some of my prospect groups right here. So I will choose the search that I want to be focusing on right now. So let's just say I, well, I am going to speak at Inbound Alaska. So I will do a search on marketers in Alaska. I'll save that search. And then all I do is I click on, you can't see me, but I am. I'll click on my Z tab first. I will drag and drop and see the yellow. That's, that's link clump at work. I will grab the, all the people in my first page of search and you see here, now it's opened up their profiles for me. So I don't have to go 1Z, 2Z and take forever. And then it's just a matter of um, letting LinkedIn do its own thing or I can physically go and check these people too. But now that it's been opened, those folks think that I have looked at their profile. And it might be a good idea to actually look at their profile if they are in fact good prospects for you. Um, but it, it just saves you a, a, a pretty decent amount of time. And then again, hopefully, if they see that you viewed their profile, right? So these people have viewed your profile in the past day, they'll see that and then hopefully they'll just go ahead and view me back. And so yes, that does help 
probably with rankings. Um, I'm going to find out because I just learned this tool. So I'll see if that helps with my rankings. But more importantly, you have hot prospects looking at you that you can now reach out to and engage with. So thank you so much, Jennifer. You are a rock star. You taught the LinkedIn expert something for which I definitely appreciate. Um, definitely go check out Jennifer. She is brilliant. Go check out her really cool toolbox. Um, and yeah, it's been Vivica Von Rosen with LinkedIn to business.com teaching you a new ninja trick.